This is amazing. You have Autogen with multiple agents and you have Assistant's API with the power of ChatGPT. You bring those together with the capability of code interpreter to analyze data. That's exactly what we're going to see today. Add code interpreter with Autogen and Assistant's API. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about code interpreter in GPT Assistant Agent. I'm going to take you through step by step on how to code and run it. Before that, I regularly create videos about artificial intelligence in my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and stay tuned. Coming to GPT Assistant Agent, we are creating an assistant and passing the assistant ID in the LLM config. Then we are assigning the LLM config to the GPT Assistant Agent. Then finally, we are initiating the chat with the GPT Assistant. I have already covered this in the previous video, which I will link that in the description below. So to include code interpreter, first we need to upload a file to analyze. So first step, file equals client.files.create, then you provide the file, which is 2021 population report, which I'm uploading. The population report looks like this, with the ISO code, country, 2021 last updated, with area, density, and more details. Now we're gonna pass this file to the assistant while creation. So it's file ID is equals file.id. You can even provide multiple IDs here. Next, we are going to provide tools list. Tools equals type code interpreter. By providing this, the assistant will have the capability to analyze the uploaded data. Then the remaining things are as usual. You're passing the assistant ID here, and this LLM config is assigned to the LLM config inside the GPT assistant agent function. So in this, as a user proxy, that's me, Mervin Prison, asking the coding assistant to analyze the uploaded population file. So the user proxy is Mervin Prison, and I'm asking the GPT assistant, what is the population trend? Give me an overview of the data and show how you solved it with code. So as a quick overview, we uploaded the file, we gave the file to the assistant, and we provide the tool set, which is the code interpreter. Then we pass the chat GPT assistant ID to the LLM config. And then you are passing that to the LLM config here. In case we don't provide this assistant ID, the GPT assistant agent is capable of creating an assistant ID automatically. Then now we're gonna run the code. In your terminal, I'm installing the PyAutogen directly from the GitHub to get the latest update. So pip install and the git URL. Next, export the OpenAI API key and click enter. Next, Python and the file name where we store the code and click enter. Now the user proxy Mervin Prison is asking the coder assistant, what is the population trend? Give me an overview of the data and show how you sold it with code. Now we got a response from the coder assistant. First, it examined the contents of the file and it gave the list of columns in the data sheet. Then it analyzed the data and the overall population trend from 2020 to 2021 is as follows. 2020 approximate population 7.6 billion, 2021 7.8 billion. So there's a growth of 1.59%. This analysis gives us an overview of the global population. That's it. We use the code interpreter, assistance API and Autogen together to analyze the data. You can even add more assistants and more agents and solve a complicated problem. I'm going to create more videos in regards to Assistance API, so stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.